right, Coach Gino here, TackleTrading.com, bringing you another trading trick or tip, otherwise known as Gino's Trading Gems. This one I got here is another think or swim tip um, that, you know, I see a lot of students and we see a lot of people using think or swim when option traders. Um, you know, one of the things I see, it's not a big deal, but th this is something that you need to know is it defaults up here to all accounts, all accounts. Let me put a little arrow there so you can see. And this is, this is great because they, you know, you have drop down accounts and stuff. And this is just what it defaults to. And it makes life easy because if you have more than one account, you can add up your profit loss. You can add up your uh, account statement. Everything balances out. But honestly, it's not what you really want to use in your real life trading. Because if you to give an example, you're missing a lot of data when you do this. There's a lot of little things. I don't have time to go through them all. But let me just show you one of them here. If I'm on my account statement, we have about five different sub tabs here. We have five different sub tabs down here. One, two, three, four, five. Well, watch what happens when I go to exactly one account. I go to margin, boom, look at all. Now there's double, right? There's a lot more. Another thing is if you're on the analyze tab, which is the most important part of your trading, the risk management, if you're on all accounts, your margin over here is going to be messed up. If just completely wrong, it's because it's mixing different mathematics, margin, cash. If you're on portfolio margin, you definitely don't want to have it on all accounts. And a lot of stuff is missing. So you want to keep it on the account you're trading from and make sure that when you place a trade, you place it in the right account. So to simply make life easier, pick your primary account. You just want to go over here to setup, hit application, and then right there on the first tab. So under setup, it's going to bring up the little window here. You go to general, right there under your accounts, you can default right here, the one account you want to log into. So I'm going to pick my margin account. This way it will stay on that account. This way you will get all your data especially on count statement and PL and all that kind of stuff. So there you have it, a simple little trick to make life easy so you're not missing out on data. Another trading gem to add to the pile. Grab some more nuggets at tackletrading.com. This is Coach G.